Good morning from Ortex. Today is Thursday, October 20th, and these are your data highlights. Tesla reported mixed third quarter results yesterday evening, missing on revenue but beating on earnings. Investors seem to focus on the top line falling short, sending shares down by 6% in extended trading. All of Tesla's factories continue to ramp production of both vehicles and battery packs. CEO Elon Musk said that production of Tesla's 4680 cells tripled on a sequential basis, while reassuring investors that the company has ample demand and expects to sell every car that it can manufacture in the fourth quarter. Musk also made an ambitious prediction that Tesla's market cap could one day surpass Apple and Saudi Aramco combined, or $4.4 trillion currently. With a current valuation of around $700 billion, Tesla would have a long way to go to achieve such a feat. Analysts have responded, with RBC, Wedbush and Deutsche all reducing their target price for Tesla. Snapchat parent Snap is set to report its own results after the bell, and Wall Street is looking for $1.14 billion in sales and a penny per share in red ink on a non-GAAP basis. The social media specialist opted not to offer guidance on revenue or adjusted EBITDA, citing ongoing macroeconomic uncertainties and a volatile digital advertising market. During the quarter, Snap had announced that it was laying off 20% of its workforce as part of its efforts to reduce its cash cost structure by $500 million annually. Snap's earnings release will set the tone for its peers that also rely on the advertising industry, including Google and Meta platforms. Snap is down nearly 80% year-to-date, but short interest has held mostly steady in the range of 5-6%, suggesting that long selling is primarily driving the downward trend. Make sure to subscribe and come back every weekday for interesting data highlights from Ortex.